This is home. It's all that's left of the once glorious realms of the Sun Goddess. Before, the land was lush. Her children thrived under the care of her lesser gods. Every creation was filled with love. Then the Moon Goddess threatened it all. Her light was pale in the bright blaze of the sun, and jealousy blackened her heart. Shadows fed off her anger and unleashed terror on our home. To cast out the darkness, the Sun Goddess shattered the realms with the brilliant light that saved us all. Yet evil still lingers in the corners of these lands, ever plotting and gaining strength. Now we call upon you. Are you ready to square your shoulders to take on the weight of the world? Earn your place in the pantheon of heroes? Well, it's time for you to prove it. Since everybody's making videos about what game they should play if they're tired of waiting for Hytale, I'll just make my own. Hey guys, my name is Realmanox. Please don't forget to subscribe as only a small percentage of my viewers are actually subscribed. Also check out my Discord and Twitter, links in the description. Anyways, straight to the point. If you find yourself suffering in the midst of the wait for Hytale, you can always go check out this free-to-play MMO voxel-based sandbox game called Trove, created by Tryon Worlds. This game isn't exactly similar to Hytale. It wouldn't be. I would say it's just about 50 to 60 percent similar. A big difference between the two is that there's no survival aspect in Trove, and you don't need basic human needs to survive. In this game, you play as a strange-looking player. You can explore, go on adventures, and create anything you want. There is many worlds to look at, each with their own stories. This game has its own textures and style of play. You start at the hub world. This is basically your safe zone where you can meet different players, customize your character and inventory, craft, and do many other things without the fear of dying. After that, you can go to the map and open the Trove universe. The Trove universe is ginormous. You choose a world that you want to go to, and you start your adventure. You kill creatures and complete dungeons to get better items. With better items, your power level increases, as your power level increases, you unlock new worlds and dungeons. There are many different classes to choose from, like Knight, Mage, Gunslinger, Dino Tamer, Vanguardian, and a lot more. Tame and mount your favorite creature from the horse to the magnificent dragon as you travel through fully destructible worlds and do whatever you want. Destroy everything, create anything, battle evil creatures and gruesome bosses with many types, mine eye-catching ores, craft legendary items, unlock chests with shiny awards, build whatever your heart tells you to, and more. There are even cornerstone sites, which are basically small areas in which you can make yourself a home, and you can take it anywhere. All you have to do is find an available spot and set up your cornerstone and it'll be there exactly how it was before. If you want an open world, voxel based adventure, MMO, sandbox, survival game thing that is partly similar to Hytale, then I would recommend Trove mainly because it's free. There are about a thousand players every month playing. Not too bad, right? Another thing that makes it nearly Hytale-like is its fan art community. There is always new worlds, characters, and items being added, and new stories being put into the different realms of Trove. It's not the best Hytale alternative, but it gets the job done. Personally, I don't play this game that much, but during the wait for Hytale, the cheapest alternative is Trove. 
Thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one.